Hello friend, welcome to The Daily Anchor, a short time set aside for encouragement in your day. We're so glad you've joined us. Hello Anchor family. Today I want to talk about God's grace. Lately I've been listening to this song, There is Another in the Fire, and the chorus goes like this. There was another in the fire standing next to me. There was another in the waters holding back the seas. And should I ever need reminded of how I've been set free, there's a cross that bears the burden where another died for me. Even though I grew up listening to these stories from the Bible, these lines reminded me of something different. For instance, Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, when they were in the fiery furnace, they were saved because of God's presence with them, literally. Disciples couldn't control the storm, but when Jesus said, peace be still, the storm calmed. Uh, we are all set free because of God's sacrifice and his grace that we receive every single day. And I noticed there is one commonality in all of these situations, and not just the, in these, but throughout the Bible, and that is his presence. His presence is what changed Saul to Paul, healed people, casted out demons, and above all, showed us how to love each other. And I feel that we need his presence now more than ever in the midst of a pandemic, crisis, pain, violence, and the conf- all the confusion that's been around. And we know that his presence is an open door, which means he is available to you no matter where you are, what you are, in whatever situation you are in, whoever you are, and whatever you are. And I want to remind these from the verses uh, from the Bible, uh, from Exodus chapter 33, verse 40. And he said, my presence will go with you and I will give you rest. And also from Psalm 16:11, it says, You make known to me the path of life. In your presence there is fullness of joy. At your right hand are pleasures forevermore. And lastly, Psalm 23:4, Even though I walk through the valley of shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for you are with me. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me. In all these verses, we have this affirmation that God's presence gives us peace, gives us, we, we can feel rest in God's presence. And there is no fear in His presence. I hope these verses and these words comfort you and encourage you to pray for God's presence in your life every day. And May you feel empowered, may you feel the love of God, and be able to share that with your friends and family and neighbors. Amen. Thanks for joining. We hope to see you again tomorrow.